Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve if your Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer is providing you an error message that reads that that didn't work. Make sure your Bluetooth device is still discoverable, then try again. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump straight into it. So we are going to first start off by opening up the search menu and search for services. Best result, should come back with services. Go ahead and open that up. Go down to the Bluetooth services. So there might be multiple ones listed in here. Go ahead just to the first one. And you want to set startup type to automatic and make sure that the service status is set to running. And you want to do the same for all of the Bluetooth services listed in here. Make sure they're all set to automatic and that they are running. And then once you've selected OK, just go ahead and close out of here. Open up the search menu and type in troubleshoot. Best match, we'll come back with troubleshoot settings. Go ahead and open that up. On the right side, underneath options, select other troubleshooters. And then underneath other, select the Bluetooth troubleshooter and then the corresponding run button. And give that a moment. And then I recommend following along with the on-screen prompts about running the Bluetooth troubleshooting utility. So shouldn't be too difficult of a process here. And again, you just would follow along with the on-screen prompts, which will be unique depending on your particular situation. So I don't want to go too far down this particular scenario or any one particular scenario because it might not be relevant for your particular Bluetooth-related device issue. So something else we can look into here as well, if you're still in the settings window, you can search for it in the search menu you've already closed out of this. But you can go back to the Bluetooth and device section then on the left panel here. So just select Bluetooth and devices. Make sure Bluetooth discoverability is turned or toggled to the on position. And you may want to consider adding the device by selecting the add device button and then following the on-screen prompts to actually add or install your Bluetooth connected device. So that's something else I'd recommend taking a look at there. So pretty straightforward process, guys. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.